This video will demonstrate how to set up trackers in TOS Plus. Trackers are very useful for those who play their characters dynamically. To demonstrate, we will be creating four different trackers, then show you how to use them dynamically on the laptop worksheet. Trackers are created on the back worksheet. Scroll down past the feed table to get to the tracker section. Let's say this cleric has acquired a wand of cure light wounds, which currently has 10 charges. Select the wand using the drop down list. You can also type any names here. Although this wand started out with 50 charges, it only has 10 charges remaining. 40 charges have already been spent. This spell planner shows the daily spell loadout for the cleric. For level 1 spells, the bless spell has been selected twice. Let's add a tracker on the back worksheet for the spell. Return to the back worksheet and add the bless spell tracker. Instead of typing a 2 for the initial value, use this trick. First, place the cursor in the initial cell for bless and type the equal sign, then switch to the spell planner and click on the 2 for the bless spell, then press enter. We have just linked this tracker's initial value with the value found in the spell planner. If the number of bless spell is changed, the tracker will automatically be updated. This trick can be applied to pretty much anything in TOS Plus, including gear items. You can even do it the other way around as we will see in the next example. Note that since the bless spell is renewable on the next day, you can set the reset to yes. Clicking the reset tracker button will remove all spent values for trackers with a yes in the reset column. Also note that it would have been possible to link the tracker entry directly to the name of the spell selected on the spell planner in the same manner we just did for the initial value. Now, our cleric picked up 5 potions of cure light wounds, which we wish to track. We add a new tracker for these, and enter 5 for the initial amount. We also need to take note of these potions in the gear section. Scroll up to the gear table, and add these potions. In the quantity column, Press the equal sign, then scroll down, click on the 5 in the available column and press enter. We just linked the number of cure potions to the number in the tracker area. If you go to the laptop worksheet, you can see all our trackers are currently displayed. If, during play, you use one charge from the wand, simply double click the number of charges to tell the sheet to remove one charge. The 10 will be replaced by a 9. The same can be done with any trackers. If you cast a bless spell during combat, double click on the 2 to denote this. If you drink one of your potions, just double click on the 5. In the tracker table, the number of available potions is now 4. Scrolling up to the gear section shows that the number of carried potions has also been reduced to 4. This is because of the link we added earlier. It also means that the total gear weight of the character and his total gold piece worth have also been automatically adjusted from having used one of these potions. Now for a final tracker. Let's say you want to track your channel energy usage. Looking in the info section, you see that you can channel energy 4 times per day. As you level up, this value will increase. Back in the tracker section, create the channel energy tracker. Instead of hard coding the for use of channel energy, we will use a special function called track info, which simply requires the name of the ability to search for. In this case, the function will automatically fetch the number of channel energy usage directly from the info section. This means that if the number of channel energy of your character changes, your tracker will automatically be updated to reflect the new total, without requiring you to update it manually. Look what happens if the extra channel feed is added to the feed table. The channel energy tracker has been automatically updated with a new number. This concludes our overview of trackers. When used dynamically, they become a very powerful tool at any gaming table. Thank you for watching.